All right, we're doing it. We're doing more cave story, finally. Oh, this one was good, right? I like this music. OG is, um... Oh, this is the original? Right, oh. I can't believe how bad this one is. I'm sorry, chat. I'm either remastered or original are the ones I like, but I want the original. That's why I'm playing this. I think I want... The visuals are nice to have the upgrade, but the original songs I just like, as they are. Oh, we're, we were finding dogs. I'm gonna have to lower the volume again. You chose classic visuals? Oh. That was a mistake. That was a misclick. I like the classic visuals. They're definitely good, but I like also... Those are good. Alright. Level down, level up! So there's a couple dogs left, right? Um... Three. There's apparently a cheat code to play as Samus. Is that true? It only works for curly mode? That's weird. It's weird that it works at all, I guess. Well, this is the Nintendo Switch version, yeah. On a Nintendo gaming console. Oh man, I need some weapon upgrades badly. This area has been kicking my ass. Just, yeah, just, just wasted all of those Doritos. Yeah, I'll... Maybe on a future stream, I'll check out the Samus. Maybe the last stream I do of this, I'll check out the Samus skin. Paw blocks. I thought I killed that dog by accident. Come on, you can't do that. That's, that's so... That's bad. That's bad. How could you do that? It's a good thing I saved. Hmm. 
not worth it. Oh, the map. Well, probably going to die, but we'll save anyway. Don't mind me, just gaming, accidentally, somehow. Hmm. Yeah. The chat called me professional gamer, little do they know. I was a pro back in the day, but I lapsed. Dumb. Stop! Oh! oh, I thought I had the bubbles. I was pressing the blue belts. See what happens when you make fun of birds? I, r I ran out of fire. Bunch of health. This is this is tough. Damn it. 
I I am just getting like man. Just take it slow. But this is a speed run. Chat, this is one of my fam famous slow speed runs. I uh you're right. I should take it slow. We're gonna do stuff like that. Okay, we're good now, chat. We're good. We got plenty of health. Doesn't mean I can't make a stupid decision and die. This is the best bet. That was the best bet. And it paid off. Oh god. No! Where is last dog, is my question. Alright, let's save here. Also means this is happening again, but it's fine. Damn. It was not fine. See, now I have to kill them to get back up there. Oh, God! Pretty, pretty decently precise jumps here. to three health. I got this, chat. I got this. We're not getting that health, are we? Progression is not to the right. 
Apparently the last dog is to the far left of this area. God damn it. But yes, it is. I know this game back to front chat member is lying, but you might be lying. I don't know anymore. I've I don't know. I don't know why I listened to chat. I should have just kept going that way. Well, we're going this way. Anyway. Okay, weapons are all maxed. I don't think... <laughs> Eating the red flower will make me strong stronger. A great many of the Mimiga believe this and choose to eat the red flower. There and only then... Or then and only then did they fight back against the battalions of robots. But do you know what happens afterwards to a Mimiga filled with such rage? It was so terrible, perhaps they couldn't control themselves while well, most of the Mimiga who consumed the red flower were never to be seen again. They went missing. I heard a rumor that they supposedly made it down to the surface, where the humans live. The thought of the enraged Mimiga anywhere close to the surface. With humans, if it is really true, do you yet realize it? Do you realize how dangerous the red flower actually is? Two more pups. You're the popular one. My dogs aren't fond of troublemakers, either. Is it the warehouse key that you're after? The same warehouse that contains all the red flower seeds in it? it? Doesn't matter to me who you are, understand? I can't give you the key to the warehouse, sorry. Opening the warehouse, that would be foolishly. Allowing an encore of the same tragedy from before. One, two, three, four, only one more to go. Arf. Woof woof. Is the dog really to the left? Oh. Oh, it's a dog. I like how none of the chat was right. Vinny, the dog is to the right. No, Vinny, the dog is to the left. Meanwhile, it was middle up. Indeed, that's the last one. Oh, you've done me a great favor, gathering my pups. Come back in a bit. I'll have something to reward you for your efforts. Wait. I have the warehouse key! Alrighty then, see you! Wait! How'd you even get in here? Oh, it's you. The key. 
key to the warehouse was stolen by Balrog. Please stop them. They'll unleash rabid Mimica possessed by the Red Flower against the surface. Wait, please take this with you. Use it and your life will be fully restored, but just once. One. What happened to the other doggos? I'm assuming the warehouse is all the way to the right up where I was going before. Well, that sucks. It's actually kind of cool how good the Polar Star is when it's fully upgraded. Since you could just, like, press the button as fast as you can. It's definitely not a weapon to just throw away. Skeleton. Ah! It's a really, like, unique arsenal of weapon. And they all have their place. I gotta do some, again, precise platforming here. Fun fact, there were insta-kill spikes in the original area in this game. Completely forgot about that. It's a lot of parrots, dude. There's still some spikes there. I don't know if they're insta-kill, but there's... they're there. Someone said save first. Go up there first. Oh. Um, I thought this was the save. I was going up that way and someone said save first. 
So I thought, like, oh, I must be going the wrong way. I need to get to a save point. Why do I read the chat? Um, no, no offense, chat. The great doctor. All the red flower seeds have been harvested. Good, by the way. The flowers blooming there. Are they the demon flowers? Yes, sir. Well, well. Such an ominous flower. Unexpected, to say the least. My great doctor, would you like to eat one? No, that won't be necessary. Well, why don't we sample it by using a Mimiga instead? Huh? Here? Wah. Hey, where are you going? Balrog, make her eat a red flower. Got it. Please don't. Eat it! Eat it! Taroko, are you alright? King? Uh, my head. No, you're that doctor. Indeed, I am the doctor. And your new leader. I should say it's a pleasure to finally meet you. Tell me, is there something that you like to do with that sword of yours? <laughs> I'm gonna kill you! Without the power of the red flower, they are weak. Oh, you're that persistent soldier from the surface. You have perfect timing. They're all yours. A small gift from me to you. <laughs> There's no need for you to thank me. Handle them, will you? Boy, really wishing I saved right about now. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm, yes. Hmm. <sighs> I mean... Oh. You, you didn't use your jar. Yeah, I'm saving that for the end of the game. But the thing is, I, I was going the right way and then I second-guessed myself and by then it was too late. The problem is, is this whole section has to be redone. Well, it's not too bad. Now it's bad. Missing a jump is bad. So that was, um, yeah, that, that, that sucked. Use some HP, please. Please, I need HP. Please. Please, I need it. Oh boy, my favorite parrots. We're really just out of reach like that.
Good enough. <laughs> Man, there's health here too. Fuck. Sorry, Toroko. Gah. I can't help you anymore. Will you avenge me? Yeah, I think they're both... Um, yeah. But hey, at least they skinned it. Oh, yeah! Sorry. <laughs> You're still alive? There's one back then, too. Tough little robot like you. There'll be no need. Oh, sorry, there'll be no end to this if we try to take you head on. I'm sending you to the labyrinth. And you, too. Huh? <laughs> that was refreshing. You were thrown down here by the witch misery too, poor little guy. The island's junk is stored here. Once you're in here, you'll never be, you'll never be able to get out. The switch for this door is supposed to be all the way up top, but the footing's real bad. I've fallen so many times that I've broken my leg. Vinny, I'm being pursued relentlessly by a hellhound I made a deal with at a crossroads 200 years ago. Any advice? I may have gotten some details of that statement wrong, but, um... You know, you, you probably just... Probably just eat a little... Sage. That's what you do, eat some sage. Apple cider vinegar. Something like that. Sword is very powerful. Whoa, I remember there being cockroaches somewhere around here as well. So many eye blocks. Mm -hmm. 
hey, whatever robots were alive went, uh, live went through there. And this one's dead. The mangled remains of a robot. Cockroach killed robot. Oh my god. Labyrinth shop? Yeah, I want to eat Mimiga. What's that skin? What that's what's that scent? Faintly smell Mimiga on you. It was ages ago, a witch lived alone in solitude here on this island. That witch would ultimately use her magic to create this labyrinth and confine us gaudy within. Your roaches. Ever seen the outside of this island? It's floating high up in the sky. How the island happens to float. The secret to that is hidden deep inside this labyrinth. A way out of the labyrinth does exist, however, the path leading to the exit is obstructed by a single boulder. I'm not even sure if the exit can be reached after moving the massive piece of rock. Hi, this is the labyrinth shop. Unfortunately, a burglar broke in recently and took everything, so I don't have anything to sell you. Sorry for the inconvenience. Wait, what's that? You've got something nice there. That's a polar star and a fireball. May I have a look? No! It's the snake, right? So, uh... When do you get the better weapon? Snake is good, spur is better. Right, I do remember that. I remember saving for the best weapon. I did, I've done that a couple times. Once you can use the jetpack in Mimiga Village. The best weapon doesn't need to level up. Oh yeah, that's right. Max Sword. I like the frog doctor is amazing. I'm a physician. Allow me to take care of you. Don't worry, I won't take your money. In exchange, please accept a simple request from me. There's an old clinic nearby. Go see... Go there and see if there's any medicine left inside. I'm a nurse. I worked on the clinic nearby. Or at the clinic nearby, but a dark ghost began haunting it. So I ran away and came here. Hi, uh, long time no see. You look great. So, uh, were you warped down here by that witch, Misery? Me too! Even you weren't able to succeed against them. I did have a tiny bit of hope. Like you, I tried my best, and this is where I ended up. Disappointed in myself. When it comes down to it, I couldn't protect them. Um, with this body in this shape, getting out of here is going to be next to impossible. I may have survived so far and everything, but what should I do now? Am I just going to rot away in here or something?
Yeah, level 3 sword is amazing. Chat member was saying that level 2 sword has no cooldown. So you could just spam massive DPS. I also like that level 3 sword is the spirit of King. Literally in the sword. Sword levels down with one hit. Yeah, that is some pretty crazy DPS. Alright, goodbye, not Balrog. This is for the good ending, you can ignore this? I mean... I'll probably end up YouTubing the best endings, but... You know... Depending on how complicated and convoluted and time-consuming the process is... Vinny, please damage boost to get that chest. Well, would you look at that? Arms barrier. What does this do? Press A on it. I just didn't want to potentially use it by accident. Weapon energy lost from sustaining damage is half. Halved. Hal halved. I guess normally that would require the, um, the jetpack. Not the- or the... Fucking machine gun float. Oh, you found it. Thank you, and sorry for your trouble. Please leave the rest to me. This is the legendary labyrinth. I don't know who built it, but it must be for some kind of trash collection. There's only one way to escape. You would have to move a massive rock that's found inside a separate chamber. I'd go with you, but my current state... I'll be more of a burden than a help. Thank you for doing what was necessary to help your friend. Tell me, were there still any ghosts? I know the, the curly stuff that is, you know, going to happen is, like, a little complicated. And I don't think I've ever successfully, could like, done it. Which is very bothersome, and I'd like to correct that today. Or whenever. Probably today.
go. Go A -E AOE sword. It's really good. Why is it like cat tank though? Oh, why not, I guess. I don't remember if there's a reason, but we'll see. Monster X. Screen flash. Guess we're not getting there. Ugh. Oh. Why are you here? Oh, I see. No? W w explain. Ending failed if you talk to him? That's kind of fucking cryptic. Wait, is it still a fail, or can I keep trying? You can ignore him, it's fine. Okay, in a minute, I'm gonna have to read chat to find out why you have to skip this dude, because I don't remember why. For Booster V2. You miss out on a good jetpack. Oh, okay. You made it. I've been waiting for you to get here all this time. If this rock is moved, we can continue onward to the labyrinth exit. Rumor has it that there's a creature's layer up ahead. Be prepared for anything. Well then, let's move this boulder to the side. Hold that end and then... Let's go. I won't move at all. Maybe it's impossible to move with only the two of us. Oh, yeah! Hey, it's you. <laughs> Though you are alive. And on top of that, you two are trying to escape from the labyrinth. Shouldn't you be resting instead of trying to make an escape? Huh? Remember that you can't defy the master any more than I can. Fine, then. I'm ending this. Just stay here with the rest of the scrap metal. Oh, this is perfect. You can grab the middle. Just does it without question. Ready? Are you two listening to me at all? Dude.
Jesus. Max HP, I have not. Feed it again. I'll move the rock for you, but in return, keep the fact that I helped move it for you a secret. Don't you worry. Here goes. <laughs> Got it? Me helping you guys. It's our little secret! Right. You might actually be one of the good guys. Don't tell me I had to not get this either. Now, come on. It's onto the lair. Oh, this music. I forgot about this music. This is good. Oh yeah, the super missiles are fucking dope. Even focus on your gameplay. Just spam. Kind of works, <laughs> you know, like some of the time. Ah, uh, the big Dorito is gone. It's okay, I didn't need the big Dorito anyway. Recognize those bubbles. Soon enough. Um, but that also means I'm gonna need chat's help in trying to... Oh, we're not quite there yet. But yeah, at, at some point I'm gonna need chat's help.
Like, how the fuck do you do, you do this sequence coming up successfully? That kind of help. Curly is definitely hacking. Okay, um, almost dead again. I got this, chat. Uh, I'm in concentration mode, I don't want to have to redo this again. is in a boo belt right now. Maybe worth it for some Doritos and some health. to do top lock. Those spikes kind of scared me a little bit. Yeah, Curly's hacking. Come on. is finally functioning properly again. Anyway, big deal. Its final destination is midway through the labyrinth. Yeah, I was gonna say, how the fuck do you even get back up there? Your voice crack is how you do it. It is very satisfying to unleash a full volley of Boobel at enemy. Still in the labyrinth? We can't pass through here. We're gonna have to keep moving forward. Ominous room. There's an item on the far right bottom corner of the next boss room. Pick it up before talking to Curly. Doesn't look like I can do that. strange place. Was it some kind of base?
glass door. It's only open halfway. I think it must be caught on something. Blast door after blast door. There's something behind all this crazy security. Don't you think so, too? You can leave and save before going in the room proper. So hit the switch, then go save. Yeah? Or save now. Hit the switch, then save. Okay. I want to do this right, so I don't mind the back seating for this. It's very cryptic, it's fine. Yeah. Yeah, I remember struggling with, with some of that. said I thought it was after the boss. I don't know. If you have a, the weaker jetpack, this item isn't here. You'll need help after defeating the boss if you want to blank. You'll be timed. I, that I also kind of remember. Look, a soldier from the surface. He's been nearly destroyed. There's others like this all over the place. Who did this? Couldn't have been a Mimiga. How could this happen? Still functional. Team 9 terminated, unable to eliminate the target. Destruction of target is impossible with currently equipped firepower. Retreat! Retreat! That's uh, just tadpoles. The sword is so good for this. It's also really, really easy to fall down. Oh, 
my god. Tw minus 20. Why though? So do you have to like not back it into a corner for the water to go back down? That's weird. You have to just go up until it goes down. Oh. You were at the lowest point of this room. Yeah, and I didn't really have a lot of air to begin with, so yeah, good point. Spending a lot of time at the bottom of that room, and that got me killed. Great. All right. Try again. This time, we got this. Cheese strat not working anymore. I misunderstood the assignment. Um. I mean, I thought for sure the air was gonna, you know, the, the water was gonna go down. This is the one. This is probably your first time doing this with no booster. That is very true, actually. Yeah, I didn't even consider that. I've never done this without the jetpack. Or booster V1 or whatever. It's amazing how close I was to killing it last time. 
Or the first time. Yeah. I had a good flow. And then, uh, yeah. Man, we need the fucking gravity suit for this boss. The game forgot to give me a gravity suit. Malpoot doesn't know. Almost really worth it to farm health here. Jesus. I can't get any higher. I can't get any higher. If you don't stay vertical, you can't, you can't get back up. Girl, we couldn't get much higher. Yeah. Come on, baby, light my fire. Remember in the Doors movie? Maybe you could say something like, I don't know, girl, we couldn't get much better. Because it was like network television and they didn't want him to say, we couldn't get much higher on, like, the Ed Sullivan show. But he did anyway. <sighs> Wait, that's what The Simpsons referenced? Um, yeah, maybe. I'm not like a Simpson expert. I'll save that for a different time in my life. When I hit 40, I'll become a Simpsons expert. So I'll let you know.
I just had a weird memory of Radiohead at Liberty State Park. And I think it's because I was playing this at the same time that that concert happened. It's amazing how memories work like that. Or maybe not at all. Maybe I'm just remembering some random thing from my life that has nothing to do with Cave Story. Oh shit. This could be it, chat. This could be over. You did it! What? <laughs> I think Curly did it. I didn't. Either that or the missile I shot was the, it was enough. How? Hey, it's the same witch who zapped me. Are those children safe? Shut it. Don't act like you're a mother. Do you even know what this thing is? Huh? This is the reason why I hate robots. It's the heart of this island. The island will fall if this stops. Do you really want to die along with the island? You stupid fool. Misery, what are you doing? Move the core to the lab now. While well, you still have time. What? Oh, wait, no, no. No, dude, no. No, dude! Is this... fine? This is scripted? Okay, so everything's okay with Curly? Still? I'm still good, okay. Did you know the woman named Jenka had a younger brother? His name was Balos. Like his older sister, he had magical powers like, unlike anyone could imagine. You can breathe. Oh, Migma Balos. I got it. Appears to still be alive. Use the tow rope. She gave me her bubble. This is timed, right? No? Oh, now I'm good? Not yet. Curly's air tank. Is there a specific path I have to go through to, um, to do anything here, or just whatever? Yes, one tricky jump. Okay. I remember that, too, being an issue of some kind. I remember just... There's multiple reasons why I've never been able to do this to save Curly, basically. That's that's what's going on here, chat. In all of my previous playthroughs, Curly died. And it actually, like, upset me. did it, I think. Read books. 
Nothing of interest. The notebook is covered in dust. Heard you got Mi'kmaed. Hope oh, you've been okay since. I got Mi'kmaed ballost. Simple. Shout outs, by the way. Text is displayed on screen. That reminds me, I also recorded some findings on that notebook. Robots manufactured on the surface have limited aquatic mobility. In the case of flooding, the system will automatically initiate a shutdown to prevent from short-circuiting. Below are instructions on how to service flooded robots. Flooded systems will begin to reboot process automatically after using the above method of draining. So yeah, this is all new to me. Nearly 20 years later, finally, Curly has been saved. You're safe. Oh, I'm glad. I thought you were a goner. You lost consciousness and I couldn't think of anything to do about it. So I gave you my air tank. It worked, didn't it? Ugh. She fell asleep. It'll take some time to complete. Would you like to leave her here? No. Exit house. Then enter and take Curly. You're good. Apparently that jump was harder in the original, and I... Also, again, vague memories of all this, but I remember this... This waterway sticks in my mind very, very strongly because of the failure I felt every time I got here. I think I did... I'm assuming three playthroughs of this game? It wouldn't seem like it, but it, the last one was like 12 years ago, more? 13? Even, maybe? Beat the next boss without taking damage for an easter egg. Like that? What was the easter egg? It was the, the jellyfish? Or I got an item? Alien metal. Engraved with the image of a space alien. It has no use. Ika? ruined the ending by killing that fish, I'm being told now by chat. It just, it respawned. Little Squid? It's a, a game before Cave Story. Something. Okay. There sure is nobody here. Oh, it's you. 
Oh, it's just you. <laughs> the doctor has amassed the red flowers. All the mimiga of the island have now fallen under his grip. Tragedy is inevitable. Had I known these events would transpire, then... I should have at least had Sue escape from the island. There we go, 2.0. Please honor my final request. If you see Sue one last time, please take her and escape from the island. She is Dr. Sakamoto's daughter. For the longest time, she resisted coming to this island, but she couldn't be left behind all alone. She had no choice but to follow us to the island. Please take her and escape. You can get the spur now. Hell yeah. So I got the spur before, chat, but I, um... Use the booster to go high above the village. So one of my playthroughs, I, I'm pretty sure I got the snake, the machine gun, and the spur. So... I have seen every weapon, technically, but I also haven't, um... One second, chat. But yeah, I just never have saved Curly before, so this is very exciting. This feels correct. And and real. Have you seen the Nemesis weapon? What's that one? I recall the name, but I don't remember if I ever... It's like a lightning gun? XP works in reverse for Nemesis, okay. Oh, right, the sleeping gunsmith, right? Start point. This is when it was more cave than story chat. to see the gun I made. Someone pilfered it while I slept. Should have just slept with the thing in my chest pocket. Had I known that was going to be the case. Wait, that's my gun! Why do you have it? I didn't make it for you. Give it back. Polar Star was confiscated. Hmm. You've apparently put a significant amount of wear on it. I... I was raised to believe that weapons should always be constructed by oneself. I always thought those who fight with a firearm created by another person are all fools. Growing overconfident with powers that were never their own to begin with. Then blaming their own shortcomings on the equipment they use. Fools. Still. But now, seeing my gun used by you with your hands, I'm so very incredibly touched. To use an incomplete gun such as the Polar Star to this degree. Hmm. Pardon my rantings. How about this? I'll give it to you. After it's completed, of course. That flashing... Why? Polar Star is now the spur. There remains a very delicate balance in this world between those who create and those who experience the creations of others. I can't say that I wasn't aware of this. However, I had never experienced it. Now, thanks to you, I finally have. As long as there is someone who will appreciate the work involved in creation, the effort is time well spent. To this end, I will continue to create for as long as I can. Thank you, Mega Man. Yeah, it's, it's like stupidly good chat. For the effort that you have to go through to get it, or like rather, you know, you kind of make the game a little harder earlier, because you're missing better weapons.
You missed the machine gun, really. Yeah, I mean, the snake is not that good, right? I guess it's okay. Snake rules, it's not as good as Spur. these dudes. It's like the Cave Story mods. Just everything. Every enemy possible filling the space. Really fill the space! Explore the space. Is there anything else here I can do with the um, jetpack while I have it? here, but if you go back to the labyrinth, you can get the tax star. What's the tax star? Can I help you? Get some business with me? Yeah? Yeah, right. You don't have any business with me. No? <laughs> See you later. Corridor. Oh, right, okay. I remember Egg Corridor being different. In these trying times. Wait, is there really something in the labyrinth, or is that bullshit? In the shop? It's kind of useless. Okay, that's all I needed to hear. There was a violent explosion all of a sudden. Everything was like this after I came back around. What the heck is going on? Oh, this music. God, I forgot about this. This is so good. It's nice when you're listening to a game soundtrack, and there's a track that surprises you. It's 
poor dragons. Are they, like, fucking bleeding from their eyes? They're, like, undead. Ow. Why is there a random dude in this game? Again. I, that will always happen. Every time I play this game, that will happen. In that exact spot. There you go. Charge shot. I don't know why I didn't do that. And then, like, I saw it, and I saw everything happen in slow motion. On Halloween... In Halloween mode, Cthulhu wears a Cthulhu costume. Oh. Is there a hidden egg entrance, or am I thinking of something different? No. A cold breeze blows through. I completely forgot about that fight. But yeah, the spur is amazing. Vinpert. What? Hello. Okay. 
incubation successful. Who's over there? Oh, it's you. I didn't know if you were safe or not. I'm the only person here. After you took off to Sand Zone, we sped up preparations for securing an escape. It was then Misery showed up. Sue was taken away. Professor Booster, he disappeared somewhere. The doctor has apparently acquired the flower seeds, but I'm not blaming you. The doctor's victory was certain from the moment he acquired the demon crown. It's only a matter of time before his Mimiga army is ready to attack the surface. If that does happen, it'll be futile to try to defeat the doctor, even for you. You'll have no choice but to run from this place. Anyway, an escape is possible, but only by using a flying dragon. That's why I came all the way here on my own. For the flying dragon that I needed, I need hatched safely. Safely. Wow, okay. Want to escape with me? Yeah, alright. I know. It can't be helped. You did your best. Oh, this music, too. Fuck, this music is also, like, isn't this like a little bit of a meme? I've seen this used in some stuff. And that was how you and Kazuma safely escaped from the island. Soon after, the doctor would use the island as his flying fortress and strike at the surface. Were the countries of the surface able to withstand the doctor's relentless attacks? That doesn't really matter. After escaping, you and Kazu Kazuma lived a humble life, hidden deep within the soul safe confines of the mountains, and out of the doctor's reach. End. It's a coward's ending. Hang on. I don't understand the, the arrangements of Cave Story Plus. I just don't understand. Wrong notes in the chord? Kind of sounds like it. Maybe you're right. I don't know. Now this... is a little bit better. These remastered ones have been pretty good across the board. Listen to Jenka too. That'll do. Okay. And then hearing that they, um, they did this so quickly is kind of insane as well. It's very crusty. It's very, very crusty, this one.
But I like it. I like it. I like it for what it is. Yeah. That kind of gets buried in the mix. Interesting. sounds. This has a lot of depth. <laughs> I, I need to. I'm sorry, I need to. There's an intro. Give it a second. I mean, it's 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 okay. It, it's not as blatantly terrible as some of the other ones. It it's not. Yeah, it's not bad. This one, I can I could live with this one. Someone said the computer one is pretty good for Cave Story Plus. Is, is... Well, yeah, there's nothing here. It's just like, like a little penis playing a keyboard, you know? Like, does the penis play the keyboard with his own tiny arms and hands, or does the penis play with the, 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 the head? I don't know. Yeah, there's, there's a lot of good stuff. I want to continue playing game, but, I mean, I could easily check out most of that music and be content with that for a while. No. Oh. Well, shit, that skipped all that, too. He said something like, maybe you could confront the doctor and try escaping before we leave. That's what I'm being told was the summation of the dialogue, which makes sense, yeah. Down into the left after you go outside. looking for the core, then you need to really hurry it up. Oh yeah, I remember this, the secret. Oh! <laughs> you were never seen again.
Yeah, that's the best secret in the game. The death secret. I see. Truth be told, there is one way you can change the Mimica back into their original state. Destroy the island's core. But the island may collapse if you do destroy the core. It's too dangerous to make- Is it too dangerous a choice for you to make? Either way, I don't know where to find the core. If you really want to try and do it, I'll wait for you. But I may need to flee the island at any time if it gets too dangerous for me. It's pretty realistic. It's like, listen, I, I might not want to be here. Little house. Where'd that husband of mine go? Have you seen my husband? Who are you? Now I can talk to the little fella, right? Should I, or should I do that another time? There will be a good time for that later. How much more game is left from here? It's only like, what? Like an hour? Like two hours? Thought, like, yeah, for some reason I always associated this area with the end of the game. Which it is, I mean, technically. There is still Final Cave, if I'm not mistaken. Why do so many things in this game launch what appears to be Spermatozoa? And I'm not even trying to be, like, gross about it. It just looks like Spermatozoa. I guess you kind of have no choice but to get a booster, right? Even if it's the shitty one? Like, okay, the shitty one's the easy one because you're just gonna talk to that dude because he fell down there. But, it's not like you can avoid a booster forever, like he just forces you to have it. Which makes sense. This is less, like, okay, in terms of a Metroidvania, in terms of, like, movement options, this game really doesn't have a ton of things. It's not like some Metroidvanias where you get all these crazy moves and, you know, you can, like, do, like, speed boosts and all that stuff. This seems to be just pretty much a booster. Go back for secret. Guns and a booster, yeah. Left of the sign with the clock on it. Boy, I really went... Very far away from that secret, huh? Still down more? Wow, okay. 
Oh yeah, I see it now. Two ninety counter. Something inscribed on the counter. I present to you the challenger in anticipation of your determination. Show me your best. That's an optional thing for hell. Um, I'm being told that the reason I missed that secret is because I was busy talking about spermatozoa. Listen, chat, what do you want me to call it? By its improper slang name? Sperm? Sperm. I don't, you know, that's, that's gross. Chat, I, lately I have a problem. I can't stop thinking about Cloud saying, let's mosey. And like, there, there's so many situations that I want to say it where it absolutely does not fit. Oh. Well, that was bad. Forgot about those things. They freeze, but they're still pretty fucking annoying. Also, this secret was really kind of just back at the beginning, wasn't it? Damn, okay. Well, let's mosey back up. I saved after I talk to the tiny people. Jeez. Jesus. Jesus. Judas. Right, the name Judas. Not very popular after the Bible came out, huh? Like, that pretty much killed that name. There's definitely more to that. That could be a good bit. It's just a shame. I wish I could sound a little bit more like Norm. Ooh-ah. Eek. Don't kill me. I'm a human. I was turned into a Mimica by magic. Huh? Oh, you mean you're not a killer robot? You startled me pretty badly by coming in here so suddenly. Are you here to save us? I'm Ito. Ito. I'm one of the humans who came to study the island. Misery gave me this lovely new Mimiga appearance. I could probably run away, but I look but look at me. How I am now. I'm stuck. I must have climbed all the way up the wall from the outside. Quite a capable engineer, but I also have an innate fear of heights. 
Ugh, I shouldn't have come to such a place like this floating island. This area I totally forgot about. Theme of cave story. Such a sassy song. Passage. Statue chamber. Halder something. Yeah. It's the vegetable man. See the vegetable man in the vegetable van. With the horn that's honking like a mariachi band. Oh. The doctor from the surface is using the Mimiga of this island to glow red uh, grow red flowers for him. Similar kinds of events have occurred in the past, too. Who are you? Oh, no. Her memory. This gal fell down near the spring. She doesn't remember who she is. Probably scrap metal now. Just one thing. I heard about some kind of special mushroom that supposedly helps recover one's memory of eating. I wonder if that'll maybe work on this poor girl, too. I know where the mushroom is! Luigi! That was my mushroom! It makes me big! Yep, that's right, Mario! We have an entire game series predicated on that fact, and that's not weird at all! That's right, Luigi! Also, this one's my cock! Oh, Mario, what? Put that away! Your chicken's not ready to hatch, Mario! Come on, it's not even noon yet! Someone said animation stuff? Uh... Man, I don't know about that. I'd probably want to redo the Luigi voice. I don't know what the fuck kind of voice that was. Oh, Mario, put that away! What are you doing? It's not even morning yet, Mario! Come on, put your chicken away! I missed a sparkle. I did. Sick sparkle, bro. It's like, me saying sick something, bro, is still a high school problem. Where people would insult each other by saying sick cock, bro. <laughs> I've told the story on stream before, and, and... I don't know why that became, <laughs> like, an insult. Chat, what do I do with this? Ignore it. Chad, this is the original animal well. Oh, 
Like when the music gets all funky. They got Mimigas working the fields? Oh no. These fucking little rabbits can't catch a break, can they? Even the vegetables are running around. Yo, haven't we met somewhere before? Must have been a Mimiga village. That witch misery brought me here. I really dislike farming. I'm gonna go clear my head with some fishing for a little bit. Do you like to fish? Well, if there's another chance, maybe I'll bump into you again. Now you can get the shiny. Oh. Fishing. Oh, it's you. I caught something strange. You can take it if you want. It's inside the bucket. It's an item of some kind. It's the teleporter room key. That was it. Oh. whole teleporter. What are you doing in here, man? Who are you? What is your face? It's weird. Hey, you. Are you dead or something? I don't, I don't remember this at all. Oh, you're awake. I thought you were already dead. Sue would smack you, and you wouldn't move an inch. This place is a jail. Those who oppose the doctor lo are locked up here to be used as a test subject for his ongoing experiments. Sue said so. You're a friend of hers? Well, you're a little bit too late. She was here as well. She worried about you so much. It was only a few minutes ago that she was carried off. Check your inventory. Also, Curly's gonna be amnesiac forever because you didn't go back and get the mushroom. Uh, no. <laughs> no. Hey, it's me, Sue. I don't remember telling you anything about us. We came to this island as a research group. It was me, my mom, Kazuma, Professor Booster, and a few assistants. The doctor was with us, too. He was supposed to take care of our medical needs, and did, I guess. But that's when... And all that changed when he found the Demon Crown! That crown used to belong to the master of this island. Grants immense magical powers to the person who dons it. The doctor knew about it well before coming to the island. It's the reason he forced himself onto our group. After he grabbed the crown, that was pretty much it. We couldn't do anything about it. The only thing we could do was continue the research of the island under his command. He seeks to rule the surface using the island as a flying fortress. From what I can tell, he plans on attacking the surface with the enraged Mimiga army. I was able to escape, however. The other researchers are probably... Well, of course, he's using the innocent Mimiga to grow a large quantity of the red flowers, and once he's ready to attack, he's gonna send the Mimiga into a state of insane rage by feeding them red flowers. His powers from the crown, he'll control them, and me too. If you can get out of the jail, please look for a hidden safe house somewhere within the plantation. If my mom is still alive, then she'll be there working on a plan of her own to beat the doctor. Please, help her as much as you can. Before I forget, the password to get into the safe house is... It's Cave Story Backwards. By the way, she snuck something in your pocket while she was taken away. Oh. Did you get some kind of love letter?
What was there a different password originally? Stun seed. Oh. I'm being told to get the mushroom. Wait, but I have to go all the way back? Is there no teleporter? You can use the teleporter now? Oh. After I get the mushroom and talk to the little fella, I'm gonna stop the stream. I was already running on a very low gas tank. But it has gotten, obviously, quite a bit lower because of the lateness. But I figure, next time I play this, I'll be able to finish it. So we've made good progress. And, uh... I finally saved Curly. So that's like a pretty historic moment for me in my own personal life, I guess. <laughs> Got that going for me. Okay, graveyard. My wife's been looking for me. That's probably because I haven't been home in a long time. Fine, I'll go home. Certainly, you'll take me there. Yes! That is an amazing graphic. But also, why the fuck was this dude just hanging out in a graveyard? For a long time. Got some business with me? Hmm, amnesia. Oh, that's terrible. Do you want the mushroom badge? But you don't really need it then. Wait. Uh. Oh, I see. Wait, you really do want it? You really want it no matter what? Yes. Then you don't need it. No. Well, then I'll give it to you. What? The fuck? There's quite a bit of cryptic shit involved with the curly quests. Ack. Found me out. That's just a normal badge. Say what? You say you're going to eat me. It's very, very... I'm a very, very valuable mushroom. And the only one in this cave, too. Snap. Don't think for one minute that I'll let you eat me without me putting up a fight. It's on. This is crazy! Didn't even see him.
dies to mushroom. How ironic. This is a really fucking weird game. And games are just weird in general, but this one is very, very fucking weird. That was a great shot. Lost. Obtained my pignon. Pignon? Pignon? My pinion. Said to have, have, uh, have the power to restore memories. That reminds me of the that time someone came into the chat and was like, Vinny, did you hear the new leaked Nirvana song? And it was just a home recording of, like, Kurt doing the song Opinion, which I had known about for a long time. And, uh, there's a dude in his house taking a shit, and he's like, oh, what's that smell? And I thought the chat member was lying. I was like, that's a lie. That's, what are you talking about? There's a song where he's, like, someone's taking a shit. And then... I listen to it, and that is exactly what happens. My opinion. Mm -mm. Oh. So yeah, I don't know what my favorite Nirvana song is. It's either Beans or My Opinion. Sorry, the name of the song is Opinion, uh, followed by the Shit Skit. Shit Remix. I have the little man, yes. Anyway, that's something, you know, just to leave off the stream. Yeah, so game is fun. Still great, and I'm seeing a lot of new content, finally. Tons of stuff I haven't seen years ago. So yeah, thanks for watching, everybody. This was good. Um... Vinny, I'm sure you said it before, but what's your favorite Radiohead song? Too Many to Lists is the name of my favorite Radiohead song. It's on Hail to the Rainbows. The King of the Bends. Okay Shaped Pool. I have a lot of favorites, but at the moment I'm gonna say I love Subterranean Homesick Alien. I love Everything in Its Right Place, Optimistic, just to name a few. All right, chat. Thank you. Um, see you around. Won't be around tomorrow, but I will be around Thursday. And uh, there will be a lot of good pre records as well. I've got some Steam Next Fest stuff and um, some other stuff as well as uh, Sulaco. So, thank you for being here, and thank you mods for helping out, and I hope you all have a good night. Goodbye.